Today I'm taking a look at the Fennec Shand Star Wars Funko Pop from Season 2 of The Mandalorian. Let's jump right into it. Hey everyone, my name is Christopher, welcome to Seriously Star Wars. On this channel I do weekly Star Wars reviews, so if you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button along with the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. Alright, so this is the Fennec Shand Star Wars Funko Pop. She is from Season 2 of The Mandalorian. Um, this She's part of that, I think it is the third wave of Season 2 Funko Pops, Season 2 Mandalorian Funko Pops. Third wave, I think it is. Um, but anyway, she's number 483 in the series. She's just a common pop, so she should be pretty easy to find still, I would imagine. Um, this came back, this arrived back in December. I had it pre-ordered at GameStop here in Canada. Uh, so, yeah, no, this showed up early. I think, it, I think it showed up early, actually, for us up here in Canada, at least, I think. Um, but, typical Mandalorian packaging here so you got the orange trim around the kind of gray and white gradient on the packaging you got your typical star wars funko pop branding so you got the funko pop and star wars logos you got the image of the funko pop the partial image the full image on the side the partial image on the back partial image on the other side partial image on the top then you got the rest of the Funko Pops in the wave there. Um, so you got... So you got the Mandalorian holding Grogu, Boba Fett, Bo-Katan, Ahsoka, Grogu with the cookies, and the Dark Trooper. And then you have Luke Skywalker with Grogu there, which I haven't done a review on. I do have a review on him coming in the next day or two. Um, then you got Fennec Shand. And then you got Cobb Vanth, which I don't have yet. He hasn't come in yet, so hopefully this week or so. Um, but let's get Fennec Shand out of her packaging and let's take a look and s take a better look at Fennec Shand. So then it also has the rest of the Funko Pops in the series. So you got Bo Katan, you got. Or sorry, you got. The Mandalorian holding Grogu, you got Boba Fett, Bo-Katan, you got Ahsoka, Grogu with the cookies, and then you got the Dark Trooper, and then they extended the wave to include Luke Skywalker with Grogu, which I have a review coming on him in a couple days here, and then I also have, then you also have the Fennec Shand, which I, I have in hand right here, and then the Cobb Vanth, which hasn't come in yet, hopefully in the next week or two, so I can complete that set. But let's get Fennec Shand out of her packaging and we'll take a closer look. Alright, so here is Fennec Shand out of the packaging. And at first impressions of this Funko Pop, not my favorite stance for a Funko Pop, but they did a really good job. Of representing her in Funko Pop form. They did, you know, her little braids and stuff in her hair with her, her orange, I don't know what they are, I guess hair elastics or whatnot. Just, they got her hair in a ponytail there. So they did a really good job on the head sculpt and the, the detail on her face and her hair there. So really nice detailed. She's got the scar on the one side there, of course. The, they did a pretty good job on her outfit as well. So you got like that same kind of orange color in her outfit. On her arms, on her legs there. On her outfit down there as well. Um, other than that, just pretty simple paint application. You know, she's got like a pouch up on her collar, up by her collar there. That's a different color, but that's pretty much it. Pretty simple paint application. Pretty simple sculpt. They did use um, a couple different colors. Like they did use the, the gloss black in parts of her outfit underneath her, her jacket, I guess what it is what that is. Same on the back. You can see kind of like a glossy 
black and then everything else is a matte paint. So nice detail there, but pretty simple stance. Not super impressed with the stance on this one, but she does look cool. Like she's not, she's not like the, the very first wave of Star Wars Funko Pops that came out, you know, back in 2012 or whatever it was. Um, but this one's, this one's really like decent stance, better than the the first stance of the, the first Star Wars Funko Pops, but not not the best stance. I'm looking forward to reviewing the Book of Boba Fett Fennec Shand Funko Pop because she's kind of like in a a kneeling stance, so I think that one might be a a better stance than this one. And when I review that one, I'll compare the two as well. So, but not a bad Funko Pop. Not my favorite, but very, very detailed. Simple paint application on her outfit. Very detailed on the hair, hair and the face. So, one of the better head sculpts, I think, for a female Funko Pop from the Star Wars universe. But, let me know in the comments, guys, what do you guys think of the, the Fennec Shand Star Wars Funko Pop from the Season 2 of The Mandalorian. Our first Fennec Shand Funko Pop. What do you guys think of her? Let me know down in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and then click over here to watch one of my other reviews. Thank you so much for watching and may the force be with you.